We are a private, not-for-profit 501c3 organization that was founded in 2008. We were established to support the South Bend Animal Care and Control Animal Shelter, which is uh, seeking to build a new facility. Our goal is to raise the necessary funds so that the city can move forward with the construction of the new animal shelter. Clancy was found uh, as a stray. She was filthy. She was emaciated and she, her, what happened was she was so filthy that they had to shave her all over. I fell in love with her immediately and knew she was the right dog for me. I uh, come here every Sunday and throughout the week um, and help by uh, socializing the animals. I help clean cages and um, one of the things that I enjoy doing the most is I take all the dogs out for a little walk. So uh, that's what I do with my time when I'm here. On an annual basis, South Bend Animal Care and Control cares for over 4,000 animals. Currently, the exclusive focus of CARE is to raise $1 million to match what the city does have set aside for the construction of the new facility. I'm involved in all aspects of the shelter, from cleaning, euthanizing, responding to calls, helping with adoptions, and generally caring for the animals. I previously had worked at Humane Society, and I thought this would be a good opportunity to continue experiencing the animal care and control field. Um, we do our best to maintain the shelter, um, to give the animals comfort, and to try to control disease. However, it's very difficult the way the shelter is set up and designed and it's also not very conductive to doing a good job disinfecting and that really hinders us when it comes to disease control. Mm -hmm. We'd be able to separate incoming animals from our adoptable animals so disease would not be a really big issue for us. Mm -hmm. um, it would be much more friendly to the public, more inviting for people to come in and interact with the animals. Mm -hmm. um, our adoptable animals we'd be able to hold for a much more extended period of time. My name is Gail Grenert and I am assistant to animal control officers. My primary responsibility is um, adoption coordinator. The high points of my job are matching a homeless pet with an adopter and seeing that it's making a huge impact on not just the pet's life but the adopters. I think it's very important because then it will attract new people, new families to come in there and so it's a lot cleaner, a lot healthier than the old shelter because the old shelter is like, it's got holes and it's got spider webs and it's not exactly a place where little children want to be. So I think the new shelter will attract more people. Um, Bailey has been with me for nine years now. He was a stray and um, went through and called animal control. and. and He's been with me ever since. Um, Isabel, she was one that um, I decided two years ago we needed another dog in the house and I saw her picture on the website and uh, had to go see her and we went and met her and we took Bailey and everything worked out so she's been with me for two years now. We, we tend to look for dogs that really need a good home more than going out and trying to find a purebred because we're not looking to breed them, we're actually looking to add to the family.